What if bad actors harness DNA printers to design viruses or biological weapons? The next technological leap brings us to the physical world. What I mean by that is these advancements don't just affect the software or digital world, but also the mechanistic properties of the real world. One such example is DNA printers. These machines that can assemble DNA sequences from scratch. The idea of printing DNA isn't new, but the progress made in recent years is impressive. Today's DNA printers can synthesize genetic material quickly and accurately, enabling the creation of custom sequences for research, medicine, and industrial applications. So just as with any advanced technology, there is a dark side. What if bad actors harness DNA printers to design viruses or biological weapons? With the right knowledge, someone could construct a virus that is both deadlier and more contagious than anything we've seen before. It can now collapse the distance between we want to create a super virus like smallpox, but like 10 times more viral and like 100 times more deadly, to here are the step-by-step -step instructions for how to do that. It's the ability to take like a set of DNA code, just like, you know, GTC, whatever, um, and then turn that into an actual physical strand of DNA. This could be done by modifying the DNA of existing viruses or even creating entirely new pathogens. As these printers evolve, it's not hard to imagine a future where bioengineering becomes as accessible as software development. Eventually, raises serious concerns about bioterrorism and uncontrolled bioengineering. So by the same logic, if we already have DNA printers today, what could happen in the next 10 to 20 years? Could we witness a similar leap, just like in the Atari analogy?